welcome to Daily Wellbeing with Gemma. Today I want us to think about uh, a mindfulness practice. So mindfulness is very much about rather than being busy and thinking about the past or the future, it's being really engaged in the present moment. And there's a couple of different ways you can do this. You know, we've done it before where we've had a breathing meditation or a body scan. But something else that's really recommended is to take an everyday activity and to just do that and that alone and concentrate on it in more detail. So common examples might be brushing your teeth and really feeling what that's like, spending time thinking about it, staying in one space. It might be things like as you sit up um, or sit down in your chair, noticing how the body changes, walking more mindfully, feeling the ground under your feet, eating food more slowly and thoughtfully, really taking time to taste everything. So everyday activities can work for this. And so what I'd like to show you today is uh, mindfully washing our hands. Hopefully we've all been washing our hands a lot more because of the pandemic, um, but we're probably doing it mindlessly. You know, we were concentrating on it at the beginning because we were concerned, but maybe now that it's just part of the routine, we're not taking time to enjoy that sensory experience. So I'm going to have a go at some mindful hand washing. I hope you enjoy it. So in order to do this mindfully, I'm going to think about engaging all of the senses, listening carefully to the sound of the water, feeling the temperature of it on my hands, and as you wash your hands, just take time to notice kind of maybe the feel of the bar of soap or you might be using liquid. So how does it feel as you turn it over? And, you know, we've been used to washing our hands in more detail than before, but have we been really feeling what it's like? All the different parts of the hands, the different surfaces running against each other. So just do it a little bit more slowly than you would normally, but still washing in detail. And just noticing which bits of your hand are more sensitive. How does the soap sound? How does it feel? How does it smell? Once you're happy that you've washed them again, rinse off and take some time to feel what that's like. Take it slowly. And again, when it comes to drying them, just enjoy how does the towel feel. There we go. So I hope you find that interesting and you might want to think about doing it in different ways. So does it feel different with different types of soaps? You can also apply this to other activities. So it might be, as I said, brushing your teeth, having a shower, brushing your hair. Those kind of activities that are just part of the day-to-day -day routine work the best because they're things that we probably do mindlessly. You know, we ignore them because they're just part of the day. And so doing those with a little bit more attention can give us that grounding and slow us down and a little bit of a chance to reconnect with ourselves. 
So I hope you enjoy that and I will see you next time. Bye.